Hey everybody, I'm uh, I'm here. I want to give you an update on um, on you know I put out a message about the investor summit. Let's do an investor summit a couple months ago. Um, and I'm here with Bertrand, who's calling in from Toronto, and uh, he's been working with me to lead this investor summit. Uh, and I wanted to wanted to bring in and and, and have him share what he's working on, particularly because you know it, usually he's in the background and stuff. His background's uh, investment banking, right? Having deals come together. Uh, and I wanted to have him have him share uh, share a story of, of how this came together. Uh, and, and, and get you to know him. So, hey, Bertrand, what um, what can you tell us about in terms of um, you know you you saw this you saw this message and and, and what happened? Well, I was I was I was always been so impressed by your Friday videos, and um, you know, and sometimes they connect and sometimes they connect less. And um, you had a call action to organize a, an investor summit, and that's exactly what. I, I do in terms of um, you know interacting with investors, bringing fundraisers to to live, doing some M and A deals, and I thought, well, I can help Tito, so I thought I'll just call you, uh, DM you, and um, and you were very good and prompt to reply to me. We had a fifteen minute window to uh, to to have an initial chat, and we connected, and uh, next thing you know is we are. Uh, We've um, we've we've got a slot with um, the Santa de X Prize uh, Summit in San Francisco in um, in early September, and uh, we we we're organizing a closed row a closed door event for thirty investors, existing and new investors, to connect and le share their learning. And I think what is really interesting about that is that we're spending a lot of time. Uh, bringing more capital into into the CDR sector. Um, one of your videos explained how we needed to triple every year the amount of carbon that we uh, remove from the air. But what does that mean? That means it entails we, we need to also most likely triple the, the amount of capital that we bring into the sector. So it's really important to, uh, to try to organize different ways of, of bringing that capital together and bringing new, new, new investors to the sector. And what's your what's your perspective on um, you know I mean you you answered this call to uh, to 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 join in this um, can you share more about what what that was like for you uh, kind of at a at a personal level so that was really interesting because I thought well I'm looking at Tito on you know his videos with his black T-shirt and his white background every Friday. And I never thought this guy would reply to me. I thought he'll be inundated by other people wanting to uh, to connect with him. But it was exactly the opposite. He just did it. He just made a call for action. I I thought the opportunity to to try to join in. But actually, if you have a certain skill set or uh, something that you think would be worth valuable to contribute to. Um, to the to the carbon removal space, just do it. Just go and contact whoever it is, either Tito or a different situation. But just come and join in, and you never know. Serendipity will bring you to to somewhere. I mean, I'm you know in in three weeks, I'm on the plane to San Francisco to go and moderate an event. Uh, you know, out of a, sim a simple you know two liner message that I DM'd uh, Tito with. I love that, Bertrand. That is that's what Aaron is all about. That's where the magic happens, right? It's it's there are things that need to happen, and and you might have the skills or the the interest or the curiosity to be the person to actually do it. And that's what that's what makes this whole thing work. From investor summits to carbon removal day to conferences and accelerators, it's really people from the community stepping up and say, you know, I'm going to make this happen. Thank you for answering the call, and I, I look forward to meeting you in person in, uh, in a couple of weeks in San Francisco.